they are absolutely destroying the traditional Western civilization yeah. right before our eyes. And, and, and what are we doing about it? Yeah, well, right. and, that's and that's why, that's why this to ask today's show, and that's right, leading into it. If, if I call it, just hold on for a minute. This is why today's show is called The Twilight Zone. <laughs> because, uh, and remember, this was a, I used to like this show. It was a psychological thriller. Yeah, yeah. You know, it was uh, science fiction. It was a number of different things, horror, suspense. But I, and I'm saying we in a twilight zone right now. This is really when, the, when I'm going to play this on the, uh, later this morning, when the president, now when a guy feel, when a guy asked the president about what was his motivation behind uh, people going into in, in high schools and in, in elementary schools going into the bathrooms, the, the guy asked him, "What's what's your motivation?" And he said, "Well, it wasn't me at all. You know, it was the schools. They they asking me to respond. That's a lie. Yes. He's a manipulator. Yes. That's a that's the first lie he said. Then second. Uh, he told the guy that, you know, these kids don't use the bathroom at all. He said, well, why can't just just keep doing what they're already doing? They wasn't using the bathroom. They wasn't going to the bathroom at all. Yeah. This is what he, he, he said. No, today, uh, my grandson, uh, I told him that that he has to minimize his, his, his drinking of water while he's in school because he go to public school. Yeah. Yeah. That I have to protect him. I have to talk to him about this. Now he's going to have to be taken out of basketball. He's going to have to go and take this self-defense class. He's eight years old. He has to. He has to learn how to defend himself. Uh -huh. be because we don't, this is the, the, the environment that this community organizer has uh, he created. I want to get to some sound bites. Hold on, uh, caller. But here, I just want to mention uh, one other thing before, because we, we're jumping a little bit ahead. I, I want to get to some other things on the other side of the, uh, of the show. But here, this is from the Washington uh, Post. It says, ugly, bl bloody scenes in San Joseph uh, as protesters attack... Trump supporters outside rally threw eggs at them, got around them, took their hats off. Mayor, these are people that were burning the American flag, waving the Mexican flag. Yeah, they, and they said yeah. that in response to uh, uh, Donald Trump's hate speech. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This isn't protesting, it's insurrection. It is absolutely an uprising against the establishment of the American rule of law. And the police have been hobbled by all of a sudden this 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 narrative that's been created about the uh, the abject widespread police brutality right. uh, mm -hmm. the white man has now become the boogeyman that, that's right uh, the thugs are, are are roaming our streets they right are. now with impunity they, they are. are not being right. held accountable for their they actions are, you're right if i ever thought yes. if i ever thought once of jumping on a police car mm -hmm. and stomping the windows mm -hmm. out i would expect to not only be arrested i would expect to be shot yes on the spot. Yes. What is happening to our community? We have got to get control of our police force, yeah. of our, our rule of law, and I don't know where our legislators are on yeah. this issue. These bunch of cowards that's right. that get elevated into high places mm -hmm. and then do nothing. Right. That's a good point because they are silent about they this. They are. They yeah. should have been calling us to attention. And this community organizer, matter of fact, he was the, uh, this is somebody that came from the streets organizing events like this right here. Right. Yeah. The, what this, this, this Disruption. So he's not saying anything at all about this at all, but he want to call out Fox News. He want to call out radio shows like this. I'm saying that we 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 use a propaganda. We misleading people. Yeah. These are all false. Everything that we do, Phil, yeah. Mayor, everything. I quote. I don't, and then I don't quote from conservative articles. I make sure I get the information from 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 uh, organizations that represent his view from liberal organizations. And then he's going to move newspapers. into, after he leaves office, he's going to move into a nine-bedroom, eight-and-a-half-bath mansion, yeah, yeah, well, a community yeah, organizer yeah, yeah. from well, the you streets know why, of Chicago. You, you know why the house is so big? <laughs> it's not really for his family. 
for all the secret service that he got to keep. <laughs> that's yeah. for them. Yeah. That's for them to roam around. Yeah. That premise. They, yeah. they got to have some place to sleep. Yeah. This community organizer has had so much disruption in America. He is going to have to. He would never, ever. He can never, ever roam the streets on his own. At, at, absolutely at all. Because he is a liar. And he's responsible for everything that's going on. That's mad. This madness is going on, and he think that. Matter of fact, here, let let's let's get to some to some sound bites. Uh, we we just getting way off off base. Here, this is uh uh. Let's play Derek, uh, sound bite. Uh, da, 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 301, 301. So hold on, but but, but let me set the uh, the premise right here. This is uh President Obama. Uh, and uh, he want to trash talk. He want to trash talk uh, uh, Donald Trump. He want to trash talk, but he don't want to use Trump's name. And, and I and I and I and I come to a conclusion why? Because you use Trump name, Trump is going to respond to you. Yeah, he's going to he, re he, he responded even though he didn't use it. <laughs> <laughs> he's going to hit back. <laughs> and so the community organizer don't really want to use his name. He want to he want to you know dance around it. You know, and let you know that that's who he's talking about. Cause he, this is what what we in now. This campaign uh, season. This is what he loved. He yeah. loved campaigning. Yeah. As this long is, as he has a teleprompter. As long as and and, and there you go, Mayor. Yeah. He was off teleprompter. Yeah. Three oh one, Derek. Thank you. Please. We're still going to have to make sure that we're paying for Social Security and Medicaid and Medicare as our populations get older. There's still going to be a bunch of issues out there, but. The agenda I'm putting forward will point us in the right direction. And the one thing I can promise you is if we turn against each other based on divisions of race or religion. Just hold it for a minute there, Derek. Just, hold, just right there for just a second. Uh, if we turn against each other, I, I notice <laughs> he still have not said anything about these riots. Yes. Right. Absolutely. Yeah. Ed, Ed Trump's. I, I'm, rallies at all has not condemned him at all, Mayor. Right, right, and in fact, that was the exact point where the teleprompter <laughs> broke. <laughs> Go on, continue, dear. <laughs> it, 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 if we if we fall for you know a, a bunch of okey doke. Okey -doke. Oh, oh, hold on, wait a minute. Let's look up that word okey doke. <laughs> <laughs> okey doke. Matter of fact, hold on. I pull up the word okey doke. I'm looking at the urban gadonomics uh, <laughs> dictionary. Matter of fact, they got a picture of Obama in <laughs> next to okey doke. And and matter of fact, they got a quote from him. And and it says you can keep your health care. Yeah. Lie. Yeah. yeah. He the one that that creates the okey doke. Okey doke, yeah. And he, he talking about exactly somebody right. with okey doke. All yeah. right, go ahead and finish, Derek. We we, we gotta. Oh. Just because it, it <laughs> you know it, it, it uh, you know it it, it, it sounds funny <laughs> or wow. the tweets are provocative. Then we're not going to build on the progress that we started. Okay, that's think, where the teleprompter think, started back that, up again. Because yeah, yeah. then he started talking like he knew what the heck yeah. he was talking yeah. about. So, and, and that's what happened when he when he get away from that teleprompter. You know, it, I, it, I thought that yes. uh, that when I first heard that, I thought mm -hmm. somebody would, you know, how they take it and it's like uh, a record, you know, and you, <laughs> oh, you, know, you oh, scratch, you scratch it, it, you know. Yeah. I, I thought that that's what it was happening. I really Has anybody really counted didn't. the number of times he said if? And Phil, I'm curious, the <laughs> progress, what, what is this progress uh, yeah. that he's yeah. talking about they made? Oh, that's right, uh, kids going into, and adults going into the women's bathroom. Well, I, I guess that's the progress. Well, you know, um, uh, one of the things about the, uh, the, the Memorial Day weekend, mm -hmm. is it was a chance for families to get together. <laughs> and, of course, you know, it gets around to the election. Yes. And, you know, I'm, I'm standing back here. <laughs> you know, I, I don't want to get in this, this yeah. conversation. I, I don't, you know what? <laughs> Phil, last weekend, I, I just steered away from it. <laughs> I, I did because um, uh, in, even part people in my family, uh, just people, period, they nice. Yeah. They, this guy, 
has put the okie doke <laughs> and the news media has helped it yes. put the okie doke well, on everybody. Everybody that, that and they blind. agreed on one thing that he brought the economy back. He saved the auto industry. You know, and I'm sitting there, you know, and I, I can't take it no more. Oh my I goodness. just I went in the backyard, yeah, yelled, you know. <laughs> I couldn't take it. I, I, honestly, I you know, I'm I, I couldn't take it no more. I had to come hey, back hey, in and, and, let's and get engage. You our first caller. All right, uh good morning, Bruce from Gross Point. How you doing this morning? Okie doke. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I swear, I swear, guys, I thought I was listening to a Reverend Jim from Taxi. Oh, you guys, <laughs> stop it. I didn't think I, about I, that I'm right there. You know, I watched some of these, uh, I watched some of these videos mm -hmm. uh, of the riots in San Jose, and the one guy had to cut ear. Another I, woman, had, another that. pregnant lady got, got assaulted and thrown to the floor. A guy in a wheelchair was assaulted oh my with a water bottle and I a had... cop was standing right nearby mm. and didn't do anything mm. and this guy mm. and his and his uh his partner the guy was helping him along in the wheelchair both were going where the blankety blank were you mm. Yeah. Mm. you know this is this is disgusting gentlemen uh and 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 janice this is this is beyond the pale. Well, it's, and, it, it, and, and the mayor of San Jose didn't blame them. He mm. blamed Trump. Mm. Yeah. Right. Mm. And that's the general consensus of all of the people that are on the Democrat side. The leaders of that party are saying it's Trump's fault. Yes. It's, this is what he gets when he says things like, uh, uh, just go ahead on and smack the guy upside the head and I'll pay the I'll pay the bill for it. You know, they brought that out and tried to make it out as if this is continuing from six months ago almost. Mm -hmm. Right. You know. Yeah. Well, well and, and he was talking about defending, defend yourself. You, yeah. you should defend yourself. Exactly. With right. these thugs. Exactly. Exactly, Dell. And I'm, I'm so glad your, your, uh, your grand, your grandson's going to be taking these self-defense courses because, you know, we would be able to cut down on ninety percent of the of the bullying incidents in school if these kids would learn to defend themselves and if they don't have the ability if they're if they're too small or you know not physically able to to do it then they should have somebody accompanying them a bodyguard yeah. now that i'll tell you what that would cut down a lot but really what we need to do guys all right have thank to, you bruce right we'll we talk to you to soon discipline in there uh, thank you bruce all right we'll see you on the other side of the break folks